Hey everyone, welcome back to another review. Today I have an awesome British figure to show you. This is Norman White. He was released in 2006. Uh, I've been trying to get another British figure for such a long time. I think it's been since May since I've gotten one. Uh, the British figures in particular are really hard to track down, especially this one. So I'm um, very happy to own this one. I paid around $80 for him and that was off eBay. So pretty expensive, but definitely I think it was worth it. This is a very nice British figure, and uh, I think he's become one of my favorites. Uh, really, really nice. So let's go ahead and show you the box. Okay, I really love this picture of the figure. I think that looks great. All right, uh, Mediterranean Campaign 1943, British Blackwatch Infantryman. And if I'm not mistaken, I did a little bit of research on the figure. I think this guy might be Scottish. I could be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, he's part of the 51st Highland Division, which I think might be Scottish. Um, but once again, correct me if I'm wrong. That would be really cool if this guy was Scottish. I think um, I love getting the different nationalities of dragon figures. Uh, but here's the back of the box. Inside and then also um, on the top is a, another pose for the figure. That's really cool All right, so really nice box And here is the figure Let's just take a moment and look at him Alright guys, so this is really an awesome figure. Uh, he was, it definitely took time to put all of his equipment on, but it really looks good once you get everything on. I love the uniform. Overall, this is a very high quality figure. Definitely one that I recommend picking up if you can. Alright, so for starters, let's take a look at his rifle. This is really cool. I love these rifles. And he poses really well with this. Alright, here it is up close. So, nice strap on that. Um, okay, there's the clip comes out very easily you can pull that back so good quality weapon and um, in the back here I do have his bayonet and the sheath I wasn't uh, entirely sure how to get that on the belt uh, these belts are really temperamental I didn't want to break it so for now I have this just uh, uh, clipped on here doesn't look the best but I think it works for now but this is really nice. So there's his is his uh, bayonet. And there he is. There it is with the uh, bayonet on the rifle. That looks really nice. All right. Okay, here's the head sculpt, which looks fantastic. Really cool helmet as well. There that is. Got the uh, padding inside. And a nice uh, strap on that. And I really like this head sculpt. I think it looks really nice. Very realistic. And uh, just... Uh, quick thing here I I don't know if you can tell from the video but this figure does have green eyes which I thought was really cool I don't see a lot of green-eyed dragon figures I thought that was something interesting to point out uh, you probably can't see that from the video but 
Just an interesting side note. All right, so moving on to his equipment. We got uh, two pouches here, and I do have ammo in one of these pouches. It came with a lot of extra clips, which I put inside of here. You can see them there. A lot of extra clips for his rifle. Okay, we got his backpack here with his, uh, we got a, a little roll there. And inside of this pack, he does come with a a big rectangular blanket, um, which you can put inside of here, obviously. And I won't take that out because it's pretty hard to uh, get all these things strapped back on, but uh, you get the idea. I really like the color of the backpack. It's kind of like this uh, pale green color. I really like that. And then down here we got his canteen. So really nice. Okay, on the side of his shirt, on the, uh, his arms rather, we have these uh, stickers that you can put on. They're a little hard to get completely uh, glued on there. Uh, but this is really cool. You can see the Highland Division and some more insignias for his division. And it's the same thing over here. So the edges kind of peel up a little bit. You got to keep kind of pushing those down. But uh, I think that's really cool. I love those insignias. Okay, his uniform is really nice. I like the, the, uh, the kind of tan colored uniform. Very nice. It's called British Khaki Drill Uniform. That's really nice. Underneath, you can see he's got a brown t-shirt. Very nice. Okay, same for his trousers. And then we got his boots, which are really nicely detailed. And then got these leggings, which of course you have to put on manually. And once you get these on, they're a pain to get on, but once you get them on, uh, they look really nice. All right, guys, so I think that's everything to show for Norman White. Overall, this is an, a really, really nice dragon figure. I highly recommend picking him up if you can find him, of course. The detail is great, and uh, I think this one's really unique. I don't really see any other figures that look like him. So, very cool, especially if he is Scottish. I think that's really cool. So, thanks for watching, guys. I have a lot of other figures to review soon, uh, so stay tuned, and I'll see you then.